children, my name's Emma. Let's start our letters and sounds lesson and learn to read some new words. Let's read some phonemes you already know. I'll show you the graphemes on the cards and I want you to read them aloud. But look out, some of the graphemes have more than one sound. I'm going to show you those cards two or three times and I want you to say all the sounds. Like this card, it says E and E. Now, it's your turn. Off you go. Brilliant. Now, let's check you've got them right. Read aloud with me. E or E. E or E. F. E. U. K or S. I or E. Y, E or I. V, S or Z. Now, I'm going to mix the cards up. Read the graphemes on the cards aloud. Are you ready? Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. V, S or Z, I or E, E, E or E, E or E, F, U, K or S, Y. E or I. Well done, super sounds. Now let's read some words. I want you to spot the graphemes which make the sound E. Are you ready? Can you spot the grapheme that says E in this word? Yes, this digraph says E. Remember, digraph, two letters, one sound. Read each sound as I point, then blend and read the word. Sweep. Sweep. You can sweep the floor with a broom that might look a bit like this. Can you spot the grapheme that says E in this word? Yes, this says E. Read each sound, then blend. Scream. Scream. You shouldn't scream if you see a spider, if you can help it, as it won't hurt you. Now, can you spot the grapheme that says E in this word? Yes, this says E. Read each sound, then blend. It's a longer word, so let's chunk it up. D -r -e -m, dream. I -ng, ing. Dreaming. Last night I was dreaming about a friendly octopus. 
That was a bit strange, wasn't it? Can you spot the grapheme that says E in this word? Yes, this says E. It's a split vowel digraph. Two letters, one sound, but the E and the E are split up. Are you ready to read? Off you go. E, v, n, even. Even though it's cold, I still love playing in the snow. Okay, can you spot the grapheme that says E in this word? Yes, this says E. Are you ready to read? Let's chuck this word up too. Off you go. Crunchy, crunchy. I love a nice crunchy slice of toast for breakfast. Now, can you spot the grapheme that says E in this word? Yes, this says E. Let's chunk this word up too. Ready to read? Off you go. R -e -s -e -n -t. Recent. Something that's recent happened not long ago. Now, I'm going to mix the words up. Can you read the words on the cards without sounding out? Hmm, I think you can. Are you ready? Off you go. Let's check. Read them with me. Sweep. Even. Scream. Dreaming. Crunchy. Recent. Well done. This grapheme can make the sound E or it can make the sound I. Now let's sort some words. Does the grapheme make an E or an I sound in each of these words? Let's sort this one. Read the word. Does it have the phoneme E or I? Help me work it out and put it in the right place. Shout out E if you think it has the E sound like in shield or the I sound if you think it makes an I sound like in pie. Help me work it out. Is it b, e, u, e, f? Or b, e, u, i, f? Point to where it should go. Yes, it's belief. Belief has the E sound, so I'm popping it here under the shield. The shield and belief. Now let's do another one. Read the word. Does it have E or I? Help me work it out. Is it F -r -e -d or F -r -i -d? Point to where it should go. Yes, it's fried, and fried has the sound I, like in pie. So I'm going to pop it here, underneath the pie. Now let's do another. Read the word. E or I. Help me work it out. Is it s-p-e-d or s-p-i-d? 
eyed. Shout out what you think. Yes, it's spied. Spied has the sound I, so I'm going to pop it here under the pie. Brilliant. Now, let's do another. Read the word. E or I. Help me work it out. Is it sh r e k or sh r i k? Tell me, what do you think? Where should I put it? Yes, it's shriek. Shriek has the e sound. So I'm going to pop it here under the shield. Well done, children. We have sorted all of the words. Now I'm going to mix the words up. Can you read the words on the cards without sounding out? Let's see how quickly you can read them. Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me and let's see how speedy we can be. Fried. Spied. Shriek. Belief. Incredible. We are on fire today, children. Now we're going to practice reading two tricky words you have read before. You know how to read this tricky word. But can you remember the tricky bit? Yes, the tricky bit is that this says or. Can you read the word? Let's read it together. Th or t thought. Now let's read another one. Can you remember the tricky bit? Yes, this says oh. Can you read the word? Let's read it together. B -e -k -o -z. Because. Now, let's read both words quickly. I want you to read them aloud. Off you go. Now let's read them together. Thought. Because. Did you get them right? Brilliant. Now let's read a sentence with graphemes we already know. Can you see any words with digraphs? Yes, these words all have digraphs. E, ch, e, v, and e. Now I want you to read aloud as I point to the words. Remember to sound out any words you're not sure of. Excellent reading. Now let's read the sentence together. Read with me as a point to the words. Sweep crunchy leaves into a heap. Let's read the sentence one more time. Sweep crunchy leaves into a heap. I hope a cheeky child doesn't jump into that heap of leaves after we've swept them all up. Wow, fabulous reading today children. So now let's finish by spelling some words. Because if you can read a word then you can have a go at spelling it. You will need paper and something to write with. Let's spell two words with graphemes we already know. Let's spell scream. Segment the sounds with me. Scream. S -k -r -e -m. Let's count how many sounds there are. S -k -r -e -m. That's five sounds. Watch me write scream with five sounds. S -k -r -e -m. E is a digraph. 
Two letters, one sound. So I need to write two letters. Mm. Scream. 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 Now, let's hide the word. Now you have a go. Say the word. Say the sounds. Write them down. Remember all five sounds. Okay, are you ready? Let's check our spelling. You show me your spelling. Did you get it right? Scream. 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 Well done. Let's try another one. Let's spell dream. Segment the sounds with me. Dream. D -r -e -m. Let's count how many sounds there are. D -r -e -m. That's four sounds. Watch me write dream and I need to remember four sounds. D E is a digraph. Two letters, one sound. So I need to write two letters. M. Mm. Dream. D. R. E. M. Dream. Now, let's hide the word. Say the word. Say the sounds. Write them down. Write all those sounds down. Well done. Are you ready to check our spelling? Excellent. Right, you show me your spelling. Did you get it right? Dream. D -r -e -m. Well done. Let's spell a tricky word. We've spelt the word because before. Now let's practice spelling it again. Segment the sounds with me. Because. B -e -k -o -z. Let's count how many sounds there are. B -e -k -o -z. That's five sounds. Can you remember the tricky bit? Yes. It's tricky because the letters A and U say O. Oh. Watch me write because. B is easy. I'm going to write the letter E for E. K is easy. Then I'm going to write the letters A U for O. Oh. And we have already learned that the letters S and E say Z. Because B E K O Z because. Let's hide the word. Now you have a go. Say the word. Say the sounds. What's the tricky bit? Remember the O oh sound is written with the letters A and U. Write the word down. Are you ready for us to check? Brilliant. Okay, let's check the spellings then. Show me your spelling. Did you get it right? B E K O Z B 
because well done children you have been brilliant today practicing reading and spelling because you've worked so hard see you soon for another lesson with letters and sounds